What is going on, Internet World? My name is Matt, and I am with We Know Vegas. Got a pretty interesting topic that you guys are going to want to pay attention to today. But first, before you get started on that, uh, make sure you subscribe uh, to our YouTube channel. There's a subscribe button down below. We'd love to have you as a subscriber. That way, you're notified every time we release some new videos, uh, when we are in Las Vegas, and all that fun stuff. So thank you for becoming a subscriber. Okay, myths and truth behind slot machines. We love playing the slots. We know a lot of you guys playing the slots. We get a lot of questions and we want to get those answers and we want to provide you guys with some truths behind how slot machines work and everything to do with trying to win that jackpot. Okay, here we go. You ready? First of all, slot machines are very sophisticated machines. Um, the ones that you're going to see in the casinos, there's some with TV personality, some based upon movies. Uh, there's a lot of different forms, a lot of different functions. So the biggest thing that you can do is just find one or two or three that you really like, that you really enjoy, that you understand the payouts, that you understand the bonuses. The last thing you want to do is sit down at a slot machine and be confused. So make sure that you're finding one that you like. Okay, the reason we're going to share this with you is because we believe that if you have knowledge, you can make your budget last a little bit longer and you can also have just a little bit more fun. First thing about slot machines, they are programmed to give a financial return to the casino. And this is based upon a percentage. You may have seen a slot machine with a 95% payback or a 98% payback. What this means in the example of 95% payback to us is that the slot, excuse me, the, the casino will keep 5% of all the dollars put in over the life of that machine over a long period of time. You've been like us, you put $100 in, bam, 10 minutes later, you've got zero. Doesn't mean you're gonna get it back instantly, but this payback means over the life of the machine. Okay, a term that you guys have to pay attention to is called random number generator. Here's how this works. Every time that you hit the uh, uh, play button, a number is generated inside that machine. Now there's millions and millions of number combinations. And when you hit that play button, it picks that number. That number matches the pattern that you see on your screen. So it works to um, mathematically, not necessarily luck. So the longer you play, yes, you'll eventually hit something big, but it all depends upon when you hit that button and when um, you're able to make that machine stop. So that's one thing to keep in mind. We've all been there when we've gotten off a machine, the next person that sits down, next pull, it's a big payout. This is not because of payouts are in order. It goes back to that random number generator. They happen to just pick it at the exact right time, that millisecond later. That's why they got paid and you did not. So don't think that the next pull is a guaranteed win because it doesn't go out in order. Okay, another myth that we get a lot of questions about is can the casino loosen or tighten the machine? And the answer is absolutely not. Again, they purchase these machines based upon a mathematical payout over time. They can't go in and loosen or tighten these machines, so don't worry about that. Another question we get a lot is why does it seem that the machines pay out when the casino is busier? Well, again, there's a lot more plays, a lot more random numbers being, all, you know, being brought to the screen in a crowd that there's going, going, going. So that's why you'll see just mathematically that on busy nights, you'll see a lot of payouts. Also, don't think that a machine is due. Let's say that you sit down, you put $20 after $20 after $20 in this machine, and you're thinking to yourself, this machine owes me, this machine is due. Again, it's all random. It doesn't based upon a certain amount of time. It is all mathematically random. So the biggest thing that you want to do is not treat a slot machine as a way to make money. You have to look at playing a slot machine as entertainment. For example, we go to a concert, we buy our tickets, tickets cost a couple of hundred dollars. We go to the concert, we are entertained, we're having a great time, we're high-fiving, we're loving everything about this concert. Well, at the end of the concert, you wouldn't expect to get your money back view slot machines as the same way. It is a form of entertainment. Make sure that you take the amount of money that you would want to be entertained with, and that needs to be the amount that you're willing to lose. 
The biggest thing is have fun. Don't stress about it. Find the machines that you like. Make sure you understand all those bonuses and features and so forth and have some fun. And maybe you'll get lucky. Pick that random number just at that right time and get a big jackpot. All right, again, this is Matt with We Know Vegas. Again, we want to encourage you to subscribe to our channel, and maybe we'll see you guys at the slot machines in Las Vegas. Bye.